Moments 2 is a roller coaster simulation game released in 2014 where players create and experience their very own roller coasters in a high detail and realistic setting. Through the years, many notable users such as CoasterMac305, Intim 305, and the Codemaster have created many high quality and detailed coasters. However, one member of the community would later go on to become a real coaster designer. This man, named Camille Bielsen, would eventually work for Intamin being in charge of layout design for many of Intamin's modern coasters. He also made a few notable moments creations, and eventually did 3D modeling for, and some scripting as well on his channel known as Coaster Lab. Though much of his work is lost to history, one notable creation is still present on his channel for all to see. This creation, known simply as The Spirit of Malbum, is an intimate launch coaster created in Nolmets 2. So let's look at this Nolmets 2 coaster and see if there are any ties to some of the real coasters Camille has designed. So starting out the ride, you're launched to a valley before going up into a top end spike by dragster with the 270 degree twist going down. And then you go up into the air and do this rapid turn, similar to that found on Taiga, which is also designed by Camille. Then there's a double inversion, which really doesn't appear on any other Intamins, so maybe we'll see him implement that one day. And then there's a twisted airtime hill, and then a dive loop, and, and, and an airtime hill, which again, on Taiga, you can actually see this, but it's done in reverse. It's an airtime hill and an inelman. There's then a low down heartline roll which you can find on Universal's Velocicoaster designed by yours truly. And after that there's a corkscrew and then a pop into the final break run. It's very admirable how someone so passionate about coasters became a designer for these rides. I personally have a huge amount of respect for this person for what he's done for only a few short years working for Intamin, designing the Wallaby Hall and Mega Coaster and even Pantheon. It's honestly great and it's nice to see a coaster he dreamed up before even working for Intamin and it gives us a big insight into what he might have planned for the future as well. But we can also observe that his design style has evolved slightly over time with him taking more inspiration from RMC and Alan Schilke's designs. I thought this video was an interesting topic to cover, not many people know major designer created Nolmets 2 coasters. If you find any connections between this and a real coaster Camille has designed, you can comment that down below, I always make sure to reply. And if people like this video, I might even make a designer profile on Camille and maybe some other people like Ron Toom or Joe Drapes. But anyway, that's about all for now. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and share this out to your friends. This is a little shorter, but I still felt making this was really cool. But moving on, I got big plans for the next few weeks, so be tuned. But anyway, that's about all I got to say today, so peace out.